I am so like overwhelmed by all the support and love I've been getting from everybody for my adventure. So thank you. I wanted to hop on real quick from my last video that I posted is just overwhelming. Um, but I do want to clarify a couple of things. I am not living in my car. Okay. I have all my belongings in my car, but I won't be living in my car. Um, I have a, a very dear friend I'm staying with and I honestly, I have a million family members up in Saranac Lake. So I'm really not worried about where I'm going to sleep. Um, I will be warm. Nobody fear for me. I will be warm and I'm not afraid to ask for help. Um, I promise you I'm not, um, beneath that. I will ask for help if I need it. Um, second question I kind of got was about the dog. People were curious about what I did with my pug. Did I leave him behind? What happened? Well, he's not really my pug. So my son is 27 and he, with him and I have been sharing an apartment, um, since my divorce. Um, it was just, he was helping me. I was helping him. It was just a very useful thing, but I did get him a pug for Christmas, um, years, a couple of years back. And I'm obsessed with the pug just as much as he was. We both love him. So it was very sad for me to leave, but he's still in his home with his owner and he's very much loved. And I will be visiting often because I just can't keep my little hands off that little pug. He's so cute. Um, so nothing to worry about folks. I didn't abandon the dog and I am not homeless. I promise you I'm not homeless. I just am not sure what I'm doing. Um, and I also wanted to just say really quick, I had a conversation with my daughter today in the car and she was a little worried and I told her, I said, you know, Merce, a lot of times we just make plans as human beings and we just do what we want to do and we make all these plans and we burst open doors that maybe shouldn't be opened. And, um, I, for once in my life, I am letting God have complete control of this situation, complete control. Um, I don't know where I'll be next week. I don't know if I'll have a job. I don't know what kind of job. I don't know what I'm going to do. And so for the first time ever, I'm just relying on God to let some things happen. I have, um, just some things that are kind of all up in the air and wherever God places them and places me, I'm trusting him, completely trusting him. And I don't think I've ever done that before. I've always kind of like wanted to control my own path and then make my own path. And, um, you know what? I'm going to let God have this one. Because I think he's got my best interest at heart and I think he loves me enough to do the best for me. So thank you all for my, for the support that you've been giving me. It's been so overwhelming. All the texts and messages I've got and comments. You guys are great. So keep up the good work and the support. Keep praying. Keep doing whatever you're doing. Sending out good vibes. Everything. It's working. I feel it. I feel so positive today and um definitely since my last video off for some reason I just feel so uplifted and very positive so you guys are doing some good work here thank you so much and I'll keep you posted I'm uh, almost to Saranac Lake so we're almost there bye